My husband just smashed our new ceiling light in anger. We got new ceiling lights to put in and my husband was just trying to put it up. He was clearly getting frustrated and I told him maybe it would be a good idea to step back and take a break and he ignored me. Anyways after 20 minutes he got frustrated and threw the new ceiling light on the floor and smashed it. Then took his electric drill and smashed it into the ceiling smashing the equipment off of the ceiling and causing the electric drill battery to fly off towards me almost hitting me in the face. He started cursing and stormed off. He has shown anger issues before but this was scary. I'm in the bedroom and staying far away from him and I'm honestly unsure of how to respond or move forward with this. I'm pretty shaken up. I can hear him in the living room going at it again cursing loudly. IDK what do do. First, do not clean up his mess. Let him see and deal with it. Second, wait until he is calm and discuss it with him. Tell him you were scared of him because of how he acted. If he can stay calm and receptive during the conversation, talk about anger management or at least some techniques for anger management. If he is not open to AM, reconsider the relationship unless you want to be afraid again. Because this won't be the last time. Anger doesn't just vanish. It can, however, be dealt with in better ways. How old is he? Like that's some teenager shit right there. At minimum, anger management therapy. At most, run. Depends on more than a few variables. My boyfriend wants to charge me rent when I don't live with him. Hey everyone. I've been saying my boyfriend for 7 months. He just recently moved places and the rent is $320 a week. He wants me to pay $100 a week out of the $320. Now here's the thing though I don't live with him. I am at his place about two nights a week but that's because he asks me to. Everything else we split food, going out etc. I will also note that he's a med student and I work full time as a junior lawyer. However, he gets money from his dad for rent whilst I pay from the money I've earned. I don't know if I'm being unfair here, but I don't think I should have to pay a third of his rent. I have paid him $400 today for my part of the rent for the next month and it is not sitting right with me. I will note that the rest of our relationship has been good. However sometimes when we're at the supermarket and he knows I'm paying he will say, let's get this one because you're paying ha ha ha. I think it is kind of childish considering I am 22 and he is 25. Quick edit I live with my family so I don't pay rent at the moment with them as I only just started working. Another edit I know you guys are saying I should be smarter considering that I'm a lawyer but personal biases always get in the way of logical thinking. Honestly, I am shocked by all of these responses I thought I would get a barrage of male comments saying that I'm entitled to not expect to pay rent. Thanks for all of the support you guys. Tell him to start staying at your place and let him know it will be $100 surely he won't have any issues with that. If you were there 5 days, nights a week I'd say a conversation about rent support would be fair but not 2 nights a week, street his request, don't pay again. No no no. This is a good reason to dump him. It's indicative of his mindest in regards to you and finances. A good man would never think of this LWT Elon ask. I urge you to reconsider this relationship. He's selfish, entitled, and he doesn't respect you. Dude sounds like a real loser. He is trying to take advantage of you. Why are you with him? Sorry this is not cute. I wouldn't pay any rent, nor spend the night. Spend time together, have fun, but if you have to pay to play. That is a hell no. It isn't if you are getting a break on your rent for being absent two nights a week. You are being taken advantage of, and it will probably escalate. Both 32. My girlfriend is cheating on me with an engaged man. I recently discovered that my girlfriend was having an affair with an engaged man for a couple of months. We only see each other on the weekends because we live in nearby cities, so it wasn't hard for her to do this without me noticing. I have solid proof, chats and pics of them. Should I share them with his fiance? Anonymously? Should I leave them out of it? I have no clue here, and I have yet to confront her about all of this. I'm stuck, I am mad, I am hurt and lost. Help me. Too long did not read. Girlfriend cheated with engaged man and I would like some impartial advice. Leave the cheater and send proof to the fiancé. She deserves to know before committing to him. Notify the fiancé, she's going to get out of it. I think you should leave as well. No one deserves to be cheated on. Yes, tell his fiancé so she can make an informed decision on what is best for her life. Then wash your hands of that mess. Just don't do like some other idiot on here that wanted to throw that bomb four years later. It's now or forever hold your peace.
If you were going to get married, and your fiancé was cheating on you but you didn't know, would you want to be informed? Or would you rather be completely ignorant of the issue and let it get worse? You should absolutely tell the fiancé. Who knows? Maybe they are in an open relationship, and this actually isn't an issue. But either way, you should tell the fiancé and explain the context as well, so they can make a full judgment of their situation. Do you need a reason to love someone? We are a month into our relationship and yesterday I asked one of those cheesy romantics questions which was, why do you love me? My partner stood there in silence for about 30 seconds before answering, just cause. Do I need a reason to love you? I was a little stumped cause I could think of reasons why I would love someone. I asked him, you really can't think of anything? And he proceeded to stand in silence for the next five minutes. He blurted out, I love you because you treat me well, because he saw that I was visibly a little uncomfortable with his answer. Am I thinking too much into this? The relationship is a month old. That's a pretty hefty question to ask this early. Yes, you are overthinking. And putting a lot of pressure on a brand new relationship. Putting people on the spot like that is rarely going to have the effect you hope for. Don't fish for validation, security and don't set your partner up with pop quizzes. Love is intangible. Not everyone is going to be able to answer a question like that with no warning. And some may not be able to put an answer into words at all. Does he treat you well? Does he express affection and care for you? Does he tell you what he likes about you in non-pressured conversation? After a month the honest answer would most likely be, I love you because my hormones make me attracted to your body. Emotions are complicated, but they don't appear just because so yes there is always a reason. That being said, it's been a month. Just saying, it's a little too soon to love someone. 